What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to do that paint splash montage effect. So for this you will need a transition plugin that I've created, it's a free download, you can find the link down below. Once you've downloaded the plugin, then what you want to do is save it in your motion templates folder. So if you open up finder and then go to go, go to home, go to movies, motion templates, transitions, and I have it saved right there, paint transitions. Once you've done that, go back into Final Cut Pro and go over here to your transitions tab and find the paint transition right there. What I'm going to do is just add this to the beginning of these clips and then overlap them. I'm going to click at the beginning of it and then double click on the transition, which will add it just to the start of my video clip. I'm going to drag it to about two seconds or maybe even three. This works best at around like two to three seconds. You want to be editing on the top of your magnetic timeline. So to do that, you have to actually press P. If you press P, then you can move your video clip anywhere you want on the timeline. Now that this video clip has a transition, I'm going to overlap it on this first clip. And you want to make sure that the video clip underneath lasts until the end of the transition. So it lines up underneath there. And then that's going to give us this which looks cool, but we want like the montage effect. So what I'm going to do is add a transition to my third clip, double click, extend this, and then I'm going to overlap this one so that it starts uh, just before the middle of this transition. It doesn't have to be exactly uh, right there, but you can play around with it and see what sort of effect you like. So let's just play that back. So now it kind of like constantly just paints on the video clip underneath, which is a really cool effect. And then you can do this with as many layers as you want. My intro video clip actually had all of these layers here, like seven layers. So yeah, you can go, you can do as much as you want on this effect. And I think it looks pretty cool. So yeah, that's the effect. All the links are down below. There is a full pack of these paint transitions, which has a lot of different styles. If you want to check that out, if you like the paint transition, I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I'll see you in the next video.